Like a lot of guys were like, I'm serving in Afghanistan, big fans of the show. One of the ways I can really take my mind off all the horrors that are happening here is listening to your show, which always kind of just surprised me because they're just like, really? Our show, which is about just complete horrors that happen in everyday life. It's, but it's the comedy of it all. He's like, it just helps us make light of the gravity of what's going on. We go to the field for a month. I wouldn't have anything to bring with me other than an iPod or an MP3 player. I'd just listen to back episodes of podcasts. I'd listen to podcasts when I was doing counseling. I'd listen to them in the gym. I'd listen to them on runs. I could clean my weapon while listening to a podcast. When you email somebody and a guy like Graham Elwood is like, oh yeah, my buddy Lucas, that makes you feel like you're part of a community. Like there's somebody else out there that actually cares that you're deployed and you're doing something because I've emailed you with opinions on things, especially the Hurt Locker. You feel like you're part of that show now. You feel like somebody actually cares about your opinion, whether they agree with it or not. And I think that's the best thing about podcasting when it comes to the military. You've got fans all over the world and we all are part of that community. If something's happening to one of us and you guys talk about it, it's all of a sudden all of our thing. You know, me being in Iraq isn't just me and my family dealing with it. Now all of a sudden, all the County Film Nerds fans can feel some relation to it. And other guys that are listening to it that may be deployed know that there's somebody else out there like them who they're listening to comedy film nerds, they're sitting in Iraq or Afghanistan and it sucks. If I envisioned a deployment where I had no podcasts to listen to, you'd be lacking in the, the feel from home of somewhat normalcy, like having a connection to still being a civilian in the United States. And it was happening from Iraq to California via a podcast with email. That's amazing. <laughs>